I think Peter Obi and Article Petition makes sense. It could lead to an interesting result. Prof Jibrin, welcome to the news and thank you for tuning in to listen. The Senior Fellow Center for Democracy and Development, Professor Jibrin Ibrahim, said he thinks that the election petition filed by P2B and Atiku Abubakar makes a lot of sense and it could lead to an interesting result. Professor Jibrin made a statement in an interview with Arise News during the Newsnet program when Charles Anyagolo asked him for his view on the election petition submitted to the election tribunal by the two major parties, Labour Party and People Democratic Party and their presidential candidate P2B and Atiku Abubakar. Professor Jibin began by saying, I think the ground makes a lot of sense and they are raising a lot of questions of law and I think the resolution of those questions of law could lead to an interesting result. However, Professor Jibin said the system, given the nature of our judicial system, the fact of the matter is that it is difficult to show that a party that has been declared winner actually did not win because the onus of proof is on the petitioner to show that every vote assigned to the winner is in fact falsely assigned. And when you're talking of 8 million votes, showing that a significant percentage of those 8 million votes were longer signed becomes an extremely difficult thing. Well, we see the now court, now court, now we will we'll do it to hear from now. All this now, then they talk, if it be, if it no be, if it be, make them leave this matter. And my own is, let them know that justice delayed is justice denied. Because we also know, we also know that most of the things are being done to buy time for the APC. Let me say we don't know. Most of the things are being done to buy time. So, if truly, truly, it be say these people, the courts won't work and they want to make it, then be made them do them in such a way, be say the law go feel work. I tell you, the law, the courts no go they adjoin this matter. This matter no be matter they go they adjoin anyhow. I they tell you, you don't get your evidence. You you don't get your own. They don't file you. You don't come. You don't come. Defend yourself. Matter don't start. They don't start. So they ask questions. They do my lord, me I, me I, my lord. And I say it's supposed to be, and then pa 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 the case then to solve them. It is either, uh, oh yes, so Tunubu won the election, or no, he did not win the election, and it is hereby. You understand? That's what it's supposed to be. So what this man is saying is, Peter B has a strong case, same as Atiku Abubakar, but there's a but he has in it, and it is that but we're actually waiting for them to say. Now that boat, waiting be the boat where they did. Do do did they have? Did they want to ask questions? Okay, which proof do you have on this particular one? Then go talk. Which proof do you have on this particular one? You get. Had it been the election was free and fair, we would have closed our eyes and everybody could not look front. But because some people wanted so badly, I still did talk, so badly to be the president, and I'm asking. The kind of work with the on ground for that part for that position, not be small work. The kind of things that are left undone, not hmm. be small work. Go at the tell now, not be small work at all. The kind of things that are left undone, because I don't talk am, eh? I don't talk am well well. The things that are left undone, it's 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 it's, it's too huge. In fact, I feel I feel that this particular sitting administration have taken the country so backwards that the person coming in go need to he go need to day forty five to come in and do his his or work. Truly, the person coming in go day as in he go day how go use tokam. He go day very very. The economy has been has been has deteriorated and is keep keep deteriorating. Should I talk about the power sector? Should I talk about the security agencies? Should I talk about the insecurity? A lot of things. It's not going to be easy walking in and doing a lot of those things. I tell you. It's not going to be easy at all. And so, that is just it. I'd like, I've been asking myself, if the country don't debarrage this place, why these people won't go there? They cannot tell me that they are going there and they are going there for good. There is nothing you will tell me that they are going there, are going there for good. Never. You are going there for good, Bitibao. It's not you are not going for good. If you are going for good, you will go through where they will see you. Abby? All right. Now, a lot of people have been asking this question. Not only people be matter than they hear, but they know here Tiku, and that um, Tiku came second. And I'm saying every, every, when, when you reach that bridge now, for now, 
Now, to number, if you get to this point where little people can't face article. Yes. They are saying, why not Peter B face article now, then later? I'm not saying no. Peter B and for now, it is between Peter B and, um, it is between Peter B and article. When it gets to that point, when it reach that point, hmm? When it reach that particular point, we'll be saying they're going to prove, oh, this one, you are the second position and you are coming out. We're the second position and you are coming out to... I'm mean, at the third position where you don't deal with a terrible finish. You will come as I come, you will come as I come face a what's it called article. So, in essence, what is actually saying is that he's trying to let us know is that this thing, this case is actually valid, it is right for what the PDP is doing and the Labour Party is doing. In fact, their case is interesting. The case, they have a very strong case. But, <laughs> the judiciary is the problem. And now, you know, I am this close to wishing it is not so. In fact, I wish if I could wish it away. This particular case with the judiciary, this election case at the tribunal, the PET. Is that the PET? Yes. The PET. I tell you, it is going to make a mother's country. Because I keep saying the judiciary, the law is the last place for a common man like you and me. A last place where I've said it several, where a video runs, oh, they won't collect all my land from you, my husband die you, eh? They won't collect all my land you, they won't collect everything, oh, I get five children, oh, I go use one more, I beg go. And you run to the long guns of the law. And because those people have the kind of bribe their way through. And leave you dejected. Chaos go for this, go for this country. Yo. No jokes. Or how do you think it would be? Someone who maybe does nothing wrong is coming back from work one day, and maybe because there was actually a crime incident, and the person is picked up. And deep down, you know this person is innocent. And because you need this person to replace somebody else and bring somebody out. You bribe the judge and the judge, before you know it, this person is serving for 8 years, 9 years, 10, 15 years. Do you know what it is going to look like? No, I want us to see the ripple effect. This is the ripple effect I'm talking about. If we allow the wrong things continue to happen, it is going to be a calamity. Let judiciary think very well of what they're going to be doing this period. This period may make a mother's country. We shall handle this particular period with care. All right, on this note, you've come to the end of the news. We say thank you for turning in to listen. Until I come your way next time, enjoy the rest of your day.